Genius Kids. Cultivating love for learning. Plants life. Knowledge acquisition. In this chapter, we will study about importance of plants. Different kinds of plants. The various parts of plants and their functions. We see different kinds of plants around us. Some plants are big, while some are small. Some have branches, while some do not have branches at all. Their leaves, fruits and seeds are different. There are many differences in their appearance. Parts of a plant just as we have different body parts, a plant also has many parts. Each part has an important role to play. The part of a plant which grows below the ground is called the root. The part of a plant which grows above the ground is called the shoot. The shoot has stem, branches, leaves, buds, flowers and fruits. Roots Root is an important part of a plant. Roots are of different shapes and sizes. Roots are of two types, tap roots and fibrous roots. 1. Tap roots. The single main root that grow from the end of the stem of a plant is called tap root. Several thinner side roots grow from the main root. Plants such as balsam, hibiscus, bean and mustard, etc have tap roots. Fibrous roots. A number of small roots growing from the end of the stem are called fibrous roots. Plants like grass, wheat, rice and onion have fibrous roots. Functions of the roots. 1. Roots fixes the plant to the soil. 2. Plants need water and minerals from the soil. Roots take these and supply them up to the stem and leaves. 3. Some roots store food prepared by the plant. We eat roots of such plants like carrot, radish, turnip, etc. Shoot. It is the part of the plant growing above the ground. It consists of the stem, branches, leaves, buds, flowers and fruits. 1. Stem. Plants have different kinds of stems. Some stems are soft and some are hard, woody and strong. These hard stems are called trunk. Shrubs have thick stems and herbs have soft and thin stems. Some plants like money plant has a very weak stem, which cannot hold the plant upright. Such plants need a support to climb up. They are known as climbers. Functions of stem 1. The stem gives support to the plant. It makes the plant upright and straight. 2. The stem carries water from the roots and food from the leaves to flowers and fruits. 3. Some plants store food in the stem. For example, sugarcane and potato. Such stems care called tuber. 4. Stem connects all the parts of the plant with each other. 2. Leaf. The most important part of the plant is leaf. Most living plants have green leaves. A leaf has many parts. The flat and broad part of leaf is called the leaf blade or lamina. A number of tiny channels in the form of lines runs all over a leaf. They are called veins. The line in the middle of the leaf is called the main vein. It carries water to the whole leaf. A number of small openings called stomata are present on the surface of a leaf. They help in exchange of gases. Plants need food to grow and live. A green leaf makes food for the plant with the help of air, water and sunlight. This process is called photosynthesis. This is why a leaf is called the kitchen or food factory of the plant. 
leaves differ in their shapes and sizes. For example, some trees like people has large leaves, while the gulmohar has small leaves. Functions of leaf 1. It prepares food for the plant. 2. It gives out a gas called oxygen. It is used by human beings and animals for breathing. 3. Some plants store food in their leaves. 3. Flower The flower is the most beautiful part of a plant. It grows on the stem. They differ greatly in their color, shape and size. The brightly colored part of flower is called petal. The green part that encloses the flower in the bud is called sepal. It protects the flower. Critical thinking Leaf is green in color due to presence of a pigment, chlorophyll. Functions of flower 1. It turns into fruit in most of the plants. 2. It makes the plant look pretty and attractive. 4. Fruit A flower changes into a fruit. Fruit contains the seeds. Most fruits are edible and sweet. Some fruits like apple, mango and banana are also fleshy. The fruits of cotton and sunflower are dry. Critical thinking Tomato, jackfruit and brinjal are fruits because they contain seed. Functions of fruit 1. A fruit protects the seed. 2. Fruits of most plants are edible. 5. Seed Fruits have seeds inside them. Some have a few seeds, while others have many seeds inside them. The first leaves that appear on the seed are called seed leaves. When seeds begin to grow, it is called germination. Most plants grow from seeds. Most new plants grow from seeds. Seeds are usually protected inside the fruit. There is a baby plant and its food inside the seed of the mother plant. When the seed gets enough air, water and warmth, the plant starts growing. It grows till it is a fully grown plant. Banana seeds do not grow into new plants. Continuous review A plant can be divided into two parts, the roots and the shoots. Roots are of two types, tap roots and fibrous roots. Shoot bear stem, leaves, flowers and fruits. A flower changes into a fruit. Leaves are called the food factory of the plants. Like, share and subscribe.